Everybody out there in pickleball land, it's Patrick and Ashley from Jigsaw Health and the Pickle Pups. Well, they're very tired right now, but you know, it's a tough job being a puppy, so it sure is. Monk and Lolo know <laughs> all about that. Well, we've got a very special guest with us today. Shall we Indeed. reveal him, Ashley? Let's reveal him. It's roll sound, Mr. Ben, ben, Johns. <laughs> ben, how are you today? Uh, well, obviously I'm splendid. I mean, look at these sunglasses, look at this gorgeous background and I have the two look of at, you. So really things look, could be look going better. Oh, I forgot the best thing of all. All right. <laughs> Looks like you are enjoying life to the fullest at this moment. It is fun to feel Yeah. Good. You know, so, some people call it off season, but, um, you know, I'm just uh, happy. I got through some exams last week and now I'm Celebrating. doing this and then I'm going to rehydrate with some jigsaw health, which, you know, fun fact for you guys, if you haven't had fruit punch with sparkling water, it's the best thing I've ever tasted. Legit, that should be everywhere. Okay. But you should, well, you what's should the pro it. tip on how to do that? Because you could oh, be no, setting you, people you up for a it. disaster. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, I, yes, I did. <laughs> it's important. Uh, pro tip, it fizzes a lot. <laughs> yeah. It, it overflows. So, so be very careful with how much you add, how quickly. Otherwise, it's going to go everywhere. But I drink it simultaneously. Well, I drink it randomly. I drink it with alcohol, after alcohol. <laughs> Anytime, really. It's, it's amazing. It's, it's a magical little. I mean, I, I drink it in a champagne flute. I, I feel classy. I feel better looking. It's just, it's, it's a, it's a miracle I mean, drink. Now that is a heck of an endorsement right there. Uh, one trick on that note: um, if you mix a very concentrated amount into a small bit of water, mm -hmm. um, basically put the powder into a very small bit of water and then add that concoction to the the sparkling, it will not fizz up. That does make a lot of sense. You know, and Ash, some people have called you smart. I think more people should. Call me a genius. Yes, correct. <laughs> well done. Uh, 
<laughs> well, usually we like to save all the product placements for the end of the video, but I'm glad that we yeah, just you know, went just, straight to the endorsement. I already podcast today. You just got to let me fly free, you know? That's okay. right. How is the Freestyle Boys podcast going these it days? It was a marathon. It was almost two hours today. We had a lot to say. Whoa. Ladies and gentlemen, be on the lookout for the next Freestyle Boys podcast featuring be Ben Johns and Rob Nunnery. Yeah, that's going to be full of some good stuff, I'm sure. So we'll definitely tune in. S some spicy stuff. Spicy. Ooh, spicy. Were there any questions of the week? Oh, there were. This was actually a Q&A marathon. There were <laughs> over 40 questions. Wow. Okay. So you are feeling good. We've got a lot. We've got I'm a lot to get great, to today. But you know what? I'm, what I'm curious for is what are we doing today? I have no idea. What am I here for? That is a good point, Ben. We did set you up with no, uh, really, no, no nothing other no than a screenshot and a calendar invite, and said, "Can you I come even talk about called. these commercials that we made?" It's a behind the scenes, and so the first one. How about we just get into it with this one? Are you ready? Yep. Let's do it. Sit back and relax, folks. Here it is. Spin. Oops. And here it is again. I got it. I got it. Thanks, Ben. I got it. I got it. Thanks, Ben. I got it. I got it. Hello, this is Jigsaw Health. Thanks, Ben. I'm on a call. Uh-huh. Yours. Thanks, Ben. The crunching. <laughs> the crunching at the, the, the end. The crunching in the background was was absolutely genius, and I just want to point out that the real star of that whole show was one take wonder Ashley, because we could only spill the drink one time. That's right. That's correct. And little known fact, one of my nicknames is also Crashly because I tend to spill things, and I like Smashly well, better. Smashly on the courts for sure. That's right. Uh, but I have multiple talents, Ben. Smashly. <laughs> ben, do you remember? So, for those of you in the audience just joining us, the goal is today to go through a number of Ben John's commercials that we've made here at Jigsaw Health headquarters and give you a little inside uh, ac access to to where the concepts came from. Ben, why don't you remind the audience, if you remember yourself, how that concept came from the I Got It commercial? Uh, yeah. Because I, I believe that was the first commercial. Actually, that was the second commercial we ever made with you. Yeah. So I don't recall whose idea it was. I'm, I'm not sure if it was yours or mine or what. But I mean, the basic premise of it was that, you know, how I how I play and think of all is often <laughs> criticized or at least uh, eyed with uh, some some interesting thoughts. Um, but yeah, I mean, obviously I take a lot of balls from people. I take, <laughs> I take a lot of court. So the, the whole thing behind that was, Hey, if I got it on the court, then I got it off the court too. Yes. I remember you, I was driving you to the airport and it would have been February of 2020. We had just played, uh, the PPA Mesa and you said, I was like, Hey, so any commercial ideas? And you're like, well, I, I get criticized sometimes for my style of play and how I take it. So we'll do, what about this script where it's like, I say, I got it. I got it. And then we were like, well, how are we going to, how are we going to land that? How are we going to make that like fun? And you're like, well, what about if like somebody like drops something and then I'm like yours <laughs> and that's how we ended up with and that's how Crashly. It was Crashly. <laughs> and I will say that to both of your credits, you worked on the pacing of that last scene probably 10, 12 times so that mm -hmm. we didn't have to like clean it up and yes. spill it every time. Uh, so avid fact, studiers. Exactly. Avid studiers. Uh, let's watch that last scene again real quick. Cause I think that is my favorite. Classy. Scene. Oh, yeah, I got it. Sure. I got it. Thanks Ben. <sighs> uh huh. <sighs> <sighs> so yours. Good. Thanks Ben. So much sarcasm in that comment. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> yep. But the, the, well, I let's... just love like it's so much like other commercials, you know, like mainstream commercials where you hear the crunching in the background at, when it goes to the fade screen. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I like the most, actually. And by the way, just in case you're wondering, I got it too. <laughs> now Excellent. we're now we're gonna fight over it. <laughs> well, let's see who's tuned in today. We've got uh Rosemary Yakabowski. Hi, Hi Rosemary. Rosemary. We've got Bart signing in. Howdy, y'all. Cheers to you as well. 
We also have uh, oh the Freestyle Boys saying yeah. it's, this sounds very freestyle. Uh, we also have the PPA commissioner himself, Mr. Connor Pardo, saying that Gosh, we're uh, I am looking just good. Racking up the celebrity appearances right now. Now, Connor, do you mean that I'm looking good? Ben, or Ashley, ben is looking it's good. It's Ashley, obviously. What are you talking it's about? Obviously, Ashley. I don't it's look your nearly as glamorous wife. as you. Are you serious? <laughs> Ash, you're amazing. That's the key. <laughs> Well, thanks. We got Even a if you know from... it's not her, you say it's her. Patrick. Correct. Unreal. I, I, I know how to do this, Ben. <laughs> We've <laughs> got... Uh, oh, actually, Connor specifying. That yes, oh, it is Thanks, Ash. buddy. Appreciate uh, you. We've got David Ash saying hello. We've got a hello from Canada. Bonjour. And we've got... <laughs> Rob Noonan jump, jumping in. Let's get to 41 questions today. Speaking of freestyle boys. Oh, buddy, Jeff Stack. Jeff Hello. Stack from the fountain. And we got, we got more. Oh, more the illustrious to... Facebook user. We love your ads and products available here in the UK. Yes, it is actually. How about we jump into the next commercial? This is actually the very first commercial that we made with Ben. It was very difficult <laughs> to schedule with Ben for, uh, his school, because he's in school right now. So it's very difficult for us to get him from Baltimore to Arizona, where Jigsaw is based. But on the first day uh, or one of the days of PPA, we're like, hey, why don't we just shoot a commercial at our booth? At the tournament. Ben, will you have some time between your matches? He's like, well, I might be able to have some time. We're like, okay, we've got a script for it. He's like, okay, <laughs> let's go for it. And that is when we end up ended up with uh, what we like to call don't be a cramper. Never. Get your fun to feel good here, folks. Fun to feel good. Get your fun to feel good here. Uh, ben, it's not called it's fun to feel good. It's Electrolyte Supreme. Oh, okay. This guy looks like a cramper. Get your electrolytes. <laughs> ben, you can't throw a product at the customer. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I laugh every time across the ground. What what a what a great little add on there. He he did such a good job. <laughs> yes, yeah. For those that didn't know, that was stuntman Randy Coleman uh, high, pulling a cameo for us in that video, um, and that that was that was sort of a I don't even remember how we came up with that script, but we were like, well. Just off the cuff. I Just mean. pretend like Ben is like basically pitching it's fun to feel good because <laughs> one of our main slogans at the company is it's fun to feel good. And we're like, how about he's just pitching fun to feel goods? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think that it's was like entirely intriguing. your idea on, on that one. It, it was pretty funny because the, the interesting part about that is we basically went into that not even knowing each other. Like I met you either that day or the day before and you're like, hey, you're down to shoot a commercial. I was like, I mean. Yeah, you guys just signed me, so yeah, I, I better be, right? Yeah. Uh, but you guys were just so so fun and cool immediately, and, uh, and shooting the commercial was just so much fun. I was like, after that day, I was already like, oh, this is going to be a lot of great. This is going to be a fun time. That's awesome. Yeah, we actually did meet you the first time the night before, I believe. So, mm -hmm. so cool. So one of the things that we like to do when we're writing commercials is we like to, we, we actually kind of like to write from the perspective of the audience. Uh, over the years now, the almost two years that we've been working with you, we've gotten to know you a lot better, but some of the commercials that we came up with were when we really didn't know you at all, but we're like, what are things about Ben that we could use in a commercial that sort of brings to light his personality um, and just sort of shows a side of him that is different from on the court? So that is, I one of the more difficult commercials that we've put together, but I think still one of my favorites is what we call the Rube Goldberg machine. <laughs> and let's show that one now. <sighs> Dang, thirsty. Oh my god! It looks simple, but how long did it take everybody? It was Twenty-four to put that takes, together? I think. 
Oh, it was a lot of takes, and I would, and I would guess we four spent, hours to put it. Yeah, up as I recall, we spent about four hours, uh, you and me and RJ and Corey uh, and Christian, putting yeah. that together. Actually, was RJ there? I don't remember if RJ was there yet. Yeah, but yeah, I think maybe it was Corey and Christian and the two of us, and we were like, "This is a uselessly complex machine." But it's very fun. Rube Goldberg, complicated. It does nothing. <laughs> exactly. I mean, and who doesn't have that on their bucket list? So it's like, okay, good. Check that off. <laughs> yeah, well, we no, wanted I... to show off your engineering side and bring <laughs> that to life. And as I recall from the uh, bloopers, which I think we might have some bloopers in here. Uh, Corey, maybe if you're there, you can weigh in. Um, the hardest part was a couple of times it worked, but the little clicker at the end that Ben used to stir the powder into the water didn't start. <laughs> the didn't easiest start. part. Yeah, the, the only piece of equipment that we didn't build ourselves. Right. <laughs> Ridiculous. Oh my god! The funny thing about so all funny. that to me was looking at it afterwards. I was like, you know, this is supposed to be my engineering, but I don't think I'm inventive to create this all on my own. Like I never would have done this. <laughs> <laughs> so I was just so happy that you guys had it. Cause you're like, Hey Ben, you have any ideas for a Rube Goldberg machine? And I was like, shoot, I'm not making that. What are you nuts? <laughs> and then I show up and it's already made. I was like, yes, that's a win. Score. No, we, we, we definitely had a lot of fun putting that together. And if you look closely at it, so first of all, this, we were like, uh, let's just pretend this is a pickleball court. This is actually the gym that is at our office. Uh, not to leak any plans, but we will soon have a court at our office. We're yes. not gonna we're not gonna drop those yet. But Ben comes walking out of the pickleball court. He's like, ah, I'm thirsty, right? And so then there's this whole little contraption that goes down that put, we had to like basically have this thing, have Ben's paddle be strong basically be heavy enough so we had to counterbalance it you've got this that then turns on a socket that turns on the fan the, the fan, fan was a real blows problem. <laughs> it was a real problem well because the fun to feel good umbrella had to be placed just properly it hits a pickleball and rolls past the jigsaw ultimate jigsaw complete and jigsaw basic packets hits a roll of fun to feel good tape lands in the basket goes past some of our products uh and then how, how did this part work i can't so remember there's like a part. string attached oh that's right there's a string uh, which, attached which to this the, basket uh, the, the toilet paper down yes and the toilet paper hits the hammer and the hammer comes down and hits this thing that cuts the jigsaw that, that's attached <laughs> so good oh yeah the paper cutter. so creative the paper cutter so and we well just done. barely missed. See, you I don't mean, you don't need the engineer for the Rube, Rube Goldberg. You need the uh, the the art guys, the the film guys, the video guys. Yeah, they're the creative, creative ones. Yeah, that's hilarious. And at the end of the day, we were like, so there's a little powder that spilled out. It's good enough. We did pretty good. I'm pretty happy with us. Well, let's check in on comments again. We've got um, Anna from Colorado Springs. Hi, Anna. We got Southwest Region Pickleball. Hello, Dre. Mr. Ron Ponder, who's actually been in a, a Jigsaw Health commercial. We've got Rob. Oh, this one time I wished I could be Randy in this commercial. Uh, Going back to yeah, uh, Randy Coleman. Speaking of Randy, I there thought Ben Johns was your guest. Who is this Hollywood hair wine guy on the screen? <laughs> Oh, great. This is vacation, Ben John. I think that's, that's I think that's Batman, actually. That's Batman. Wow, the hair. What kind of product do you use, Ben? I think we need to turn this into the Ben John's hair show. This is this is all natural. There's nothing. <laughs> wow. <in> there. <laughs> wow. Hey, Ben. Rob A. from Cleveland, Ohio. And uh, nice. Montgomery, Montgomery the, the man. man. Hi, Give Montgomery the man. Out. There's your shout out. Montgomery County is where I grew up, so. Good name. Nice. We can see your beautiful date from the glasses. <laughs> Does your date want to reveal herself? Nah. <laughs> nah. Okay. Well, let's get to another video. Um, the one, the ones that we've shown so far, those three were from the first time that you were here. And in fact, the first time that you came to our office was, I think, like August of 2020. Arizona in August is ridiculously hot. So, so hot. most of the stuff that we filmed thankfully was inside. 
Uh, but, but then we went and played pickleball in the afternoon. Well, yeah, of course, of course. Because we're crazy, but that's fine. But one of the one of the things that I really appreciated about you, Ben, was yours was really, I think, the first visit that we started like realizing how quick we could move. So mm-hmm. what for we those got a lot that done don't, very quickly. I think we, we got, got like a lot seven commercials in a day. Yeah. Well, you were Actually, a natural. We, we got we got I think one take wonder John's. That's all they six. call me. That's right. right. <laughs> Actually, he's got it. He's he, got it, folks. He's not kidding. Ben is very good on his takes, and really, what you look for is either a lot of consistency or a lot of creativity and like a lot of randomness. I'm the Random. randomness. I don't do well with scripts. Ben was like consistent every time, and maybe maybe that shows up in his game versus my game. Yeah, I'm likely. Hmm. Oh, well, noted. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was one of the other commercials that we made while you were here, and we call this one Good Ben Hunting. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> here we go. I can't believe it. Ben didn't clean the whiteboard. (sighs) (laughs) That was a real problem. Someone actually told me that they (laughs) looked at the board. They paused Uh, it one time and like looked at the whole board. They're like, yeah, he actually did that right. (laughs) Really? I thought you were just writing random things. Yeah. So what, what, what does that problem solve, Ben? Uh, that is a Feynman integral. It's nothing I would actually really use. It's just a uh, famous physicist, Richard Feynman. It was his particular technique of solving a certain type of integral. Wow. I don't know what he said there. It sounds legit. It sounds legit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go with that. <laughs> Rosemary says, I love this commercial. It shows another side of Ben. He's not just pickleball. He's smart. But what does that mean? Rosemary, Everybody I, I tried really hard. No. But he, he's not very good at getting coffees. Uh, which is sort of a two part. I think of that as two part. First, let's get to Corey. Hi, Corey. He's our director of uh, production here, video productions here at Jigsaw Health. I agree. Best commercial. Matt Corey's the man. Would be jealous. So yeah, as, Corey, good, as you, Rob you really said, make everybody look good. That's yes, right. Indeed. Um, Rob Noonan, uh, Good Ben Hunting, the sequel. So there's a different commercial that we have that I think of. Uh, that it's almost like it's the prequel to Good Ben Hunting. Mm-hmm. I almost wish I should have played that first, come come to think of it. That's but okay. we'll show it now. We call this one Ben the Intern. <laughs> this is gonna be our most successful launch ever. I'm really hey excited. Hey everybody, I have your coffee. Awesome. There you go, boss. Ben, mine was supposed to be iced. I asked for soy milk. I ordered a nine shot, one pump mocha, non fat, no whip with exactly four shakes of cinnamon. This is only three. I'm sorry, guys. I can fix this. Let me just get these back. You should probably stick to pickleball. Mine's plain water. (laughs) I love that one. Uh, I remember this one took so long simply because everyone couldn't stop laughing about the plain water. (laughs) Yeah, Johnny would not stop messing around and like saying different renditions of the plain water. This is just helicopter water. Yeah. Yeah. We're like, Johnny, we're never going to get through this if you keep saying helicopter water. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Oh, my gosh. That was so hilarious. So fun. Well, and Ash, kudos to you. That was quite a line that you delivered in there. And I feel like she said it? it before or something. I am. I would have to practice it a couple times. but like uh, The coffee diva. Yes, totally. This is only four. Or this is only three, <laughs> is only shakes, three shakes of cinnamon. Of cinnamon. <laughs> Well, and the reason that I think of those two commercials together, one, we kind of wrote them at the same time, two, we recorded them on the same day, but three, it really shows sort of like Ben's character. It's almost like my perception of Ben's character is that he's like this young intern that we make us, that makes like, we make him he, go get he us coffee. He makes him go coffee runs and he has to like mop the kitchen floor. Yeah. <laughs> So, but then he turns out to be like a genius. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So to me, it just it had a funny sort of side of your. It was a good spin on it for sure. Your your character. Um, how about we do the? I guess you want to do this one or stays out of kitchen. 
Yeah, let's stay out of the kitchen. Okay. So this is one that definitely has gotten a lot of great feedback. Um, this is a convert. We call this one uh, kitchen. Well, what do we call it? Stays out of kitchen. We'll just show it. Yeah. Thanks. Hey, uh, Katie, could you pass me the creamer? Why don't you just come into the kitchen and get the creamer? I can't. I can't come in the kitchen. Sure you can. No, I, I really can't. You can come into the kitchen as long as you don't hit the ball out of the air. All right. That's why I stay out of kitchens. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> I mean, I love this one too. I just remember the first take of that. Patrick missed me with the ball. I was like, Patrick, come, <laughs> come on. on, Patrick. You were three feet away. I, well, look, I'm not that accurate. I probably needed glasses that day. Yeah. I, I, we got a couple people commenting that the favorite is the kitchen. Yeah. Rosemary, my favorite is the kitchen. Oh, Rob gave a nice compliment there. Now, Rob, do you mean Ben's commercials or Jigsaw commercials are consistent? Both, right? obviously. Obviously, that's good pretty answer, good. Good answer. Anna, the best keep it, keeping it life. safe, safe for work. Some funny Since ever. stuff. <laughs> um, oh gosh, we have a wardrobe question. Please tell me you're wearing corduroy pants with the turtleneck. <laughs> so much swag. <laughs> uh, no, no, no corduroy, but no corduroy. Maybe course, next I'm time. Sporting the turtleneck. Yeah, I'll bear that in mind. What a I think one of the great things about that commercial with Do Kate, uh, so Kate works at, a, <laughs> oh, whoa, catching grapes? Someone's beating him. Trying. <laughs> I missed, though. Well, Here's you know, I maybe try again. Pause. Try one more time. I'm looking straight in the sun. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that was a good. That was good. Just good balance. Oh, that's great. Michael Fishman in the house. Oh, hey, our buddy Michael Fishman. Hey, Michael. And we no, got uh, uh, a freestyle boys comment. Mm -hmm. Ben doesn't do belt loops. Is this oh, true, Ben? No belt loops. Oh no, I, I do belt loops. Rob doesn't do belt loops. Okay. Okay. Good. That'd be a good uh, girl. Got to change that one up. I see. We've got a. Our favorite commercial is the bad <laughs> hair day. We'll get oh, to that's that a good one. one. Uh, I well, maybe we just move on from the in the Let's kitchen. Move on. Yeah, it, it was a great commercial, it was done so well. Oh, we're losing a Ben Johns. <laughs> All right, continue. <laughs> we still have Ben with us. We've had we had some uh comical difficulties, yes, too good. So, we're freestyling it. So, let's go with um, how about Ben takes a phone call. Yes, I like that. So this was the this was from the second time that Ben was here. Or do you want to do uh, what's in your bag? Let's go with it. Okay. So this was from the second time that Ben was here. One of the things that we've noticed with all the pros that we have had the chance to work with is that the first time they come, they're like pretty comfortable. But compared to the second time, they're like way comfortable. They know they sort of trust us that like if Corey says, yeah, I got what I need. They're like, okay, moving on, moving on, like on to the next thing. Uh, so this was an example of Ben takes a phone call, which is kind of a throwback to, um, well, the one sided phone call conversation that uh, his name is escaping me. I'll remember it. A but, comedian. Yeah. Thanks for calling Jigsaw Health. This is Ben. How can I help you? I'm sorry. She's not in today. I agree. She is an excellent pickleball player. I believe it's uh, J-A-R-D-I-M. No, I'm not sure how to pronounce it either. <laughs> yes, her picture is on the front of the bag. <laughs> okay, how many bags would you like to order? I'm not sure we have that many. <laughs> <laughs> great I delivery, great delivery on that, Ben. I don't remember how we were, we, we tried a couple different ways on how we were going to land that plane. Yeah. The, Do you remember the finish that? Was, was interesting. Yeah. We, I wasn't sure how to, how to finish, but we tried a couple, a couple different ways and landed on that one. Um, yeah. I think that that one was actually one of the more difficult ones. Didn't take too long, but it, it was one of the most. Which is why we have great bloopers from that one. So we should show those. <laughs> well, exactly. Perfect cue. Cue the bloopers. 
right second one down up here yeah there you go there we go yes her picture is on the front of the bag <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is uh, for real. It's time to take one. <laughs> Beautiful. And then you gym the camera. Hold, 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 hold. Let me turn it a little bit for you. So it's a compilation of bloopers on that one, but. Oh, it's good stuff. Always love the bloopers, you know. <laughs> bloopers are my favorite. And someone noticed, uh, oh, it was Corey. Well, of course, Corey would notice. So there was a Danny Warfel cameo there in the back. I think it makes sense to uh, show yes. the Danny commercial. Yes. Let's do that one. So for those that don't know, Danny Warfel was the, I think it was 1994 Heisman Trophy winner. It's ancient. Ancient, ancient history. <laughs> it was before Ben was born. <laughs> Way before. I was 99. There you go. 99. Wow. Just before the millennial. Millennium. Falcon? Never mind. Uh, so <laughs> Danny, uh, ha ha he was like, well, what if we did some sort of video with me and Ben where I'm trying to Im import to him the like how important it is to be like, safe? safe. Yeah. And we're like, okay, well, what if we did Danny Werfel, the pickleball safety manager, which, by the way, was filmed in this office that we were sitting in, and his sign is still on my door out there. So my office still looks like it's Danny's office, which I think is great. So let's get it with Danny Werfel. Hey, hey, Ben, Ben, come here. Hey, Danny. Hey, check this out. <laughs> oh, cool. No, 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 it's, it's not the final product. Our graphics department is still working on it, but uh, you're gonna love this. These are awesome. Is this really necessary for pickleball, Danny? It's just one ounce of plastic. Ben, Ben, trust me, you're in a professional sport where people are trying to hit you. You need all the protection you can get. Safety first, because plastic hurts. Yeah, but... Just remember our motto. Watch your blind, blind side, side or, or you'll, you'll be on, on your hind side. side. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Danny. Later, Gator. All right. <laughs> Go, Gator! <laughs> Danny Werfel. Safety first, because <laughs> plastic hurts. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, Available on jigsawswag.com. <laughs> <laughs> gotta uh, get one just, of these. Every time I went to the back and forth with Danny, we just uh, we laughed like probably ninety percent of the time. It wasn't that our takes were bad; it was just we couldn't stop laughing. It was exactly, so... exactly. Oh gosh, my cheeks hurt very badly. I, th I think the, the, the highlight day. of my weekend, though, it, it was beating uh beating Danny Lefty. Well, Danny and his son, right? Yes, so you played and Jonah, singles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, were, you played they singles against they were them. Win. <laughs> and I think they gave you another handicap too, where you couldn't hit a backhand two-handed. Yeah, so I yeah, it, it was something like I couldn't do a two-handed backhand unless I was at the net. My gosh, so, that was fun. Yeah, do you remember what the end score of that game was? I was like 11, 8, 11, 6 or something. <laughs> How do you remember that? <laughs> oh, vaguely. Vaguely, probably not exactly right. Didn't it, but the the more important part was there was some there was something else bet on the line. Uh, it... Yeah, Jonah had to serve me dinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, hilarious! That is great. good time. Oh, I like how Danny didn't have anything on the line. They just no, it off yeah. on his son. That's right. Exactly. Hoist it on on the boy. Rosemary, thank you. I also love this shirt. Uh, which Ashley mentioned, you can get at jigsawswag.com. We got Randy saying, nice to see Danny having fun there. We had a blast. And speaking of Danny having fun, speaking of the two of them going back and forth, we have some more bloopers to watch. We've got the Ben and Danny bloopers. Are you sure that one gets into bloopers? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, ben, trust me. You're... <laughs> trust me, Just I know. Safety first, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Safety first at Jigsaw yeah, Pickleball. But... Cause safety first, cause plastic. <laughs> Remember our motto. 
Watch your blind side, or you'll be, be on your blind side. Yeah. Our motto. Just remember our motto. Remember, <laughs> that's not it. <laughs> Watch your hindsight. Or you'll be. Or you'll be weird if you're looking at your hindsight. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Danny. Later, Gator. <laughs> you gotta take the pads. Later, Gator. <laughs> Later, Gator. <laughs> Go, Gators. <laughs> <laughs> So good. Oh my gosh. Just people often ask, uh, do we have fun at the office? Just absolutely. a little bit. Yes, just a absolutely. little bit. Yeah. yeah, I told you most of those cuts were just laughing. Yes. Gosh, that is so funny. Yes. Um, well, let's see here. We have a couple more that we could go through. I think I want to save the Can I just the find end, out where else? you're at, Ben? Because you made us wait until the live stream started and then we never actually talked about That's it. That's true. And I think everyone is curious about this beautiful backdrop you have and where you are. Uh, I am in Austin, Texas at a winery. Nice. And that is another answer to a question that came through. What is Ben sipping on? Can you give us a hint as to uh, the grape choice you've got going on there? Oh, the delightful. I, I don't know. I don't know. What <laughs> it's white. <laughs> it's white wine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Vignette. Oh. Vignette. Vignette. Jocelyn, can you pronounce for me? Vignette. Uh, is he talking to us or someone I, I there? Don't, I, I don't know. Oh, it's, it's Jocelyn. J. Jocelyn. Oh. Duvier. Duvier. I thought it was Duvillier. Yeah. Du, Duvier. I mean, it's close to his name. It's very French. Jocelyn, yeah, if you're out wine. there. Yeah, that's the name of the wine. <laughs> oh, it is. Okay. Yes. <laughs> uh, okay. So let's go with, let's go with this one. Cause this one has actually kind of a, a fun trick that we did. So this one, um, it's kind of funny that a lot of people will come up to Ashley and I, when they see us at pickleball tournaments and say, I love your commercials so much. They always make me laugh. Uh, in fact, one of the common things we hear is that they they love them so much they'll like rewind and watch them again when they're watching like a live stream or whatever. It's like, hmm, I think if people are rewinding to see the commercial, we're doing that's something right. That's the best compliment. Yes. The funny the part is that I'll terrible. ask them like, well, that's great. Do you uh, have you had a chance to pr try our products? And sometimes <laughs> people will say, I actually don't even know what you guys do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm so, sure. your, your so for those of you too entertaining. Exactly. So those of you wondering what it is that we actually do, we we focused on making a serious a series that we call What's in Your Bag, kind of like the What's in Your Wallet. And Ben, Irina, and Simone, I think, have made those commercials. Yep. Here is Ben's version. Oh man, my mouse battery's dead again. I got you. Man, I'm still hungry. Oh, there you go. Thanks, Ben. Oh, oh cramp. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh man. Here you go. Take oh. a cocktail. Oh, thanks, Ben. Oh, man. I got it. There you go. Uh, thanks, Ben. Gosh, that last part is just brilliant editing. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Literally brilliant editing to uh, pull a broom. The premise for that commercial was... Was Mary Poppins, obviously. Obviously. And it's like sort of the thing that we see where we're like, well, what is it? You know, a paddle is yay big. What's what do they keep in those bags? Everything. Like what's in there? So Everything. we like to have the pros like basically, I mean, I'm prepared for anything. Prefer you need cookies, you need napkins, you need pickleball cocktail. Got you covered. I actually did a real bag check with Hannah at, uh, at one of the uh, tournaments. I was like, ah, well, 
We're going to have to be careful in here. I don't know. There could be a lot of stuff in here. You don't want to see everything. <laughs> there's any you basically of live out of those things. things. Uh, yeah, no, there's a lot in there. <laughs> That's right. Fits well, and, think. and I think obviously one of the very funny parts was that was the second time you were here, whereas the first time Ashley was spilling something. And the second time Ashley was spilling something. Spilling something again. It's kind of my I mean, thing. Once again, yes. being crashly. Crashly, and also, crashly strikes again. Yeah. And also notice Ben never helps me clean up my messes. He just <laughs> I mean, hands I me the room. He doesn't even try an, to I, clean I it up. I offered you a tool to help you clean up your own mess because you're a big That's problem. right. And I need to learn my lessons. An entire push. push That's room. true. <laughs> and also Rosemary says... Ashley has the best eye rolls. Thank you. I would say as her husband, I can actually confirm that. Yeah, I get a lot of practice. <laughs> That's right. Oh, <laughs> hers, are the, hers are the best off the court. Mine are the best on the court. Yes. Speaking of eyes, court. your sister. Hi, Natty. Our COO at Jigsaw Health. Oh, Aunt Natty. Aunt Natty, who does have the prettiest blue eyes. She does. Hi, Natty. Uh, well, let's see. Okay, we've covered a lot of ground. We usually spend about 40 ish minutes, so we're reaching about the actually. This is, this is like we're timing this perfectly. Yeah, I mean, if anybody has any questions, maybe have them throw it out there. Ben, should there be a questions of the day? I mean, questions of the day. Yeah, I mean, if you want me to do the voice, I'll do the voice. You don't need to ask me twice. Sean's questions asking. of the week, questions, <laughs> questions of the week. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, I love it. Oh, so good. Uh any we'll questions one, come through? We'll take one of your favorite. Ash gets to choose. Okay. Uh well we if anyone one. has any. We've already kind we of such a flawless oh. job. Maybe you guys don't have any. Well, Natalie is asking what kind of hair gel you use because her her son wants to know. Well, you know, now I actually already like answered six. that earlier in the day, and the answer is there's nothing this in this is, at all. That's just that's just hair, man. Um, he just hasn't washed it in a couple of weeks. That's that's more <laughs> accurate, actually. <laughs> I know. I'm on to you, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, how about we play? Let's go with um, do this one, or we could do. Let's do the heist. Yeah, this is my favorite. Well, I mean, they're all my favorite, but let's do the heist, that's and then we've got bloopers. Too. Okay, here anything we go. with Irina in it, in it is always my favorite. All right. Well, here we go. Irina Tarashenko, which for the record, as far as we know, does not work for the KGB. But she also told us to say that. So we can't confirm. We or can't deny. confirm. Their lunch break is almost over. Ben, Irina. Are you guys almost done? We gotta get that new fruit punch flavor ready to ship. Sure thing, Carissa. We were uh, almost finished. Good, we got a lot of orders to fill. Why are you guys wearing ski masks? It's like 110 degrees out. Bad hair day? Mm-hmm. Always goofing around. Ben, have you ever really had a bad hair day? Oh, for sure. <laughs> Just lean into it and, you know, Just act like it's on purpose. today is not that day. <laughs> um, okay, oh, so I get great. to pick uh, a question for you to answer answer and i would like to ask so rob noonan says ben can you tell tell us how the jigsaw family has changed your pickleball life that's a good question um i would say i mean i they are technically a sponsor but uh i i wouldn't really consider them uh a sponsor so much as like you said family uh that, that's a really good term for them uh just because like i feel very close with you guys you're great friends I mean, I call you uh, aunt and uncle, so that that really speaks for itself. <laughs> so it's just been really cool that I can uh, I can actually talk to somebody on a on a very personal level that you know they're supposed to be a sponsor, so to speak. But it's it's much more pleasant to have them as more of a, a personal connection, and you know, people that I 
uh, care about in the pickleball world rather than, you know, just uh, another sponsor. That is very kind of you to say, and it is a pleasure getting to work with you. The I feeling like, is mutual. Yeah. Very I mean, mutual. Cheers to that. Rob, thank you for asking that question. It feels a little cheesy and corny, but it's at, oh my God. <laughs> He's at a winery, folks. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, on that note, do you want to watch the bloopers of the heist? Uh, yes, we'll watch the bloopers and then we'll let Ben get back to whining. I want to. Yeah, I want to throw. I want, I want to throw out one great thing about the heist, though. When we filmed that commercial, as Corey mentioned, it was actually 116 degrees out that day, and we did have to film some of it outside. But the Best part might have been that we, a, a lot of our scripts, like we kind of know what's going to happen. Like I knew that Ben was maybe going to catch a grape there, but I wasn't certain. Oh, so we play yeah. into it. And we're like, well, let's see what happens. And so when we got to that part and they were pulling off the ski masks, we're like, what are we going to, what are we going to say? And it was like, how about bad hair day? Yeah. Like as the excuse. The funny part is, is Ben went to my barber the next day, got a nice fresh haircut, oh, and that so line fresh. would it that line would not have worked had you gotten, had the, you haircut gotten the haircut a day prior. It's not only a we, bad hair day up here; it's a bad facial hair because I had <laughs> shaved in like two weeks, and it was yeah, it was not good. And then when you pull the mask off, it just makes it even more messed up. So All it's like you know what, we got to lean into yeah. this here. Terrible. Yeah, it was the beard was getting a little piratey. It was a solid play though. Solid uh, you know, play. I'm dedicated to my work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Bad hair day? <laughs> Bought me in. We're supposed to act? <laughs> Again, acting this time. Oh, it's the it. hardest so part of all the commercials. So I've ever done. We got it. In. Got it. <laughs> Most challenging role. Of my oh, career. <laughs> so good. Oh, I read it. Oh, he's so hilarious. And it was 116 degrees that day. That's right. Well, th this is actually, we got one more question from Randy Coleman that I like. I think uh, a, a brief amount of pontificating. Besides winning and being the most consistent winner in pickleball history to date and the money, what is your favorite part about being a part of pickleball? Ben, why do you love this sport so much? Oh, I mean, that's easy. It's definitely the people you meet. It's, you know, a lot of them are really cool, interesting people, very nice. Uh, and mostly it's just variety. I've always been a variety person. I love variety in my life uh, and the variety of people that you get from different backgrounds, what they do, you know, what, what they follow, what they're interested in is just so dramatic. You, you meet cool people like from week to week and uh, you really can't replace that. It's uh, something that's pretty unique. I've never found it anywhere else to this extent. I love it. I love Agreed. it. Agreed. Should we ask this question? Uh, sure. Okay. Ben, you look like a million bucks. The world wants to know, is Ben Johns a millionaire? Uh, you know, I, I can't say I am yet. I'll, I'll let you know when that happens. <laughs> but like one, that's the, <laughs> and I would say the key phrase is, not yet, but pickleball not is taking no, off. I definitely will be, but not yet. Good. Amen to right. that. Well, Ben, thank you so much for taking a part of your day. Uh, we really have enjoyed the beautiful view. The, I've enjoyed the, watching you fall. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> out of your chair. <laughs> See? Highlight. Highlight reel. We, Just one continuous highlight reel. That's yeah. right. We'll falling get you back all. to... Falling, we'll catching back. food. I'm basically a circus act. <laughs> one maybe, man circus. Maybe this is one part, you know, part of inspiration for a next Ben Jones commercial. Oh, okay. All right. The wheels are turning, everyone. Stay tuned. Well, on that note, everybody, have a great day. Thanks for joining us. Ben, thanks for being a part of this. Enjoy the rest of your week. Happy Thanksgiving out there to everybody. Any final words, Ben? Okay, bye.